Amos Star Cook, December 1, 1810 to March 20, 1871, was an American educator and businessman in the Kingdom of Hawaii. He was patriarch of a family that influenced Hawaii during the 20th century. Amos Star Cook was born in Danbury, Connecticut, December 1, 1810. His father was Joseph Platt Cook, 1760 to 1841, and mother was Anna Starr, died 1813. His grandfather Joseph Platt Cook, 1730 to 1816, served in the American Revolutionary War. Juliet Montague was born in Sunderland, Massachusetts, March 10, 1812. Her father was Caleb Montague, 1781 to 1825, and mother Martha Warner. They were married November 27, 1836, and in less than a month in the 8th Company from the American Board of Commissioners for Foreign Missions to Hawaii. They sailed from Boston December 14, 1836, on the Mary Fraser and reached Honolulu on April 9, 1837. The Cooks were put in charge of the Chief's Children's School. King Kamehameha III selected as students those who would be eligible for the throne based on their family background. Instruction was in English, and all five of the next ruling monarchs were students at the school. A complex of buildings was built to house the Cooks and students in 1840 as it became a boarding school. In 1846 it was renamed the Royal School, and became funded by the government. In 1849 Cook worked for Samuel Northrop Castle who had been a shipmate on the Mary Fraser a secular supply agent for the mission. As the American board reduced funding for the Hawaii stations, he co-founded Castle and Cook as a private company in June 1851. Edward Griffin Beckwith, 1826-1909, became the next principal of the Royal School as it opened to students of all races. The business started as a general store, and continued as supply agents to the mission. Their storehouse is part of the Mission Houses Museum. Cook made one trip to supply mission stations in the Marshall Islands and Gilbert Islands. In 1858 Cook became a partner in the Hike Sugar Company on the island of Maui. During the American Civil War in the 1860s, the company became an agent for selling sugar from the sugar plantations in Hawaii to the western United States. However, Cook's health declined and he turned over his duties to Joseph Ballard Atherton who had started as a clerk in 1859. Cook died in Honolulu, March 20, 1871. The company went on to be one of the big five corporations that dominated the economy of the territory of Hawaii. Their seven children were. Joseph Platt Cook was born June 15, 1838, married Harriet Emily Wilder, 1842-1904, sister of Samuel Gardner Wilder and died August 29, 1879. Their son also named Joseph Platt Cook, 1870-1918, married Mog Mansfield Baldwin, 1872-1961, daughter of Henry Perrine Baldwin, co-founder of Alexander and Baldwin. Martha Eliza Cook was born November 21, 1840, married Samuel Thomas Alexander, 1836-1904, the other co-founder of Alexander and Baldwin. She died July 6, 1918. Juliet Montague Cook was born August 21, 1843, married Joseph Ballard Atherton, 1837-1903, in 1865 and died August 25, 1921. Their daughter Mary Atherton Richards, 1869-1951, wrote several histories of the family. Mary Annis Cook was born November 6, 1846, married Charles Turner, 1845 to 1894, and died in 1920. Charles Montague Cook was born May 6, 1849, married Anna Charlotte Rice, 1853 to 1934, on April 30, 1874. He became president of the Bank of Hawaii and C. Brewer and Co. Their children included scientist Charles Montague Cook Jr., 1874 to 1948, and businessman Clarence Hyde Cook. 1876 to 1944. Son George Paul Cook married the granddaughter of missionary Garrett P. Judd, and their son was musician Francis Judd Cook, 1910 to 1995. He died in 1909. Amos Francis Frank Cook was born December 23, 1852, married Lilan at Lualu Lidgate, 1856 to 1946, and died in 1931. Clarence Warren Cook was born April 4, 1856. Married Clara Lydia Mosley, 1857-1941, and died March 4, 1880. His wife Juliet Cook died on August 11, 1896. 
Most of the family is buried at the Mission Houses Cemetery near Kauai Ohio Church.